Well, all right, all right. The moment you've all been waiting on. No, I'm just kidding. Probably nobody's waiting on it, but I'm going to do it anyway. This is the tutorial on the FTM 300 group message. So here we go. Once you're in your frequency that you've chosen, then you choose group monitor. This is what it looks like before you do group monitor. Then you hit group monitor. Now, I got a cheat sheet over here I'm going to read off of so I don't get it wrong. So the first thing you do is once you're at this stage, you push group monitor. Then you press the F setup. Then there's no touch screen on this one. So no touch screen. So turn the dial to log. Press the dial. Turn the dial to message. Press the dial. Set the dial to new if it's not already there. Now you get to this screen where once again you can do nothing. So what do we do? We press F setup again to bring up this menu again. And then edit. Now you can type. You can't type. You can only run this little scroll wheel around and you can hit all your buttons. Don't go past the ones you need and you rotate to the the letter you need this is the only way to do it i mean this is almost slower than old school texting on a nokia i imagine if you counted you could probably figure out the fastest way to navigate this thing go to the next letter the more quickerest i'm from i'm from okoy kind of a redneck guy i can make up my own words we're allowed, I don't know if I can spell though, let me see if I can spell. All right, so anyways, boom, we did it, we did it. So after you type your message, press the dial. I'm just kidding, don't press the dial. <laughs> let me delete that. Let me, let me figure out where I'm at on the list. Press the dial, writing the message. Now I gotta scroll, cause I got the font so big on my screen, I can't see it all. Um, now you long press the dial, the dial, right? Boom. Then you press F menu, and now you have that menu down there again. And they probably have figured it out. Some of you guys are smart. You just hit send, and you choose the destination. I'm going to go ahead and hit my call sign. Hit sending. I'm pretty sure that it sent. <clears throat> and where did it go? It went here. So, we, uh, we go here, God dog it, log, uh, message, KO4 TNL, that one right there, and it says, please subscribe, except I missed a C. Y'all could have told me I missed a C. You let me do that. Anyways, that is how you do it, and that's how you check it. Hopefully this, uh, hopefully this video has somebody uh, been benefited by it. That would be great. And um, yeah, sending messages like this, they're not encrypted. People can get them. But look at the factors. Number one, it's only going to my call sign because it's digital. And it's got a tone on the frequency. It's pretty secure, but obviously not 100% secure. Because it's not encrypted. But it is a way to send messages quietly, discreetly, without squawking on the radio. Anyways. Please subscribe if you can. Give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment. That if it helped you. I don't know, that'd be nice. I, I don't think I'd have any more radios to do. I did the 200. This is a 300. I did the 400. I did the 500 and the 510. Uh... I guess I should probably show you how to do it with the FT5DR. That might be the next one. Anyways, 17 steps to get it done. But, you know, once you get doing it, it's really not hard. So I will, uh, I will say 73, guys. And see you later.